is a great question. By the way, this question is over a year old and only one person has answered it, but I'm going to answer it today because today is a milestone day on LinkedIn from my perspective. And I'm going to tell you why in a minute. So what's the best way to respond to a LinkedIn Connect request? Well, first of all, I think the wrong thing to do is to rapidly hit the accept button. I think that's the wrong thing to do. Secondly, I also think it's a missed opportunity just to simply hit the ignore button. I think what you should do is give that request at least 10 seconds and do a little research at least a few seconds and do a little research and maybe figure out who is this person, quickly determine if they're fake or, or, or real, and is this person relevant to me? And then there's other things that you can do along the way uh, as a part of that process, but the best way to respond to a LinkedIn Connect request is just do about five to 10 seconds of research. Now. Why is today, January 27th, 2024, a milestone day on LinkedIn? Here's why. Today is the first day that we have hit publicly from my LinkedIn profile a billion LinkedIn members. January 27th, 2024, again, is the day that I see that we have 1 billion plus LinkedIn members. That is a milestone day. Yes, LinkedIn's been touting that there's been a link, um, billion profiles uh, for a few months now, but this is the first time that I see that number in on LinkedIn. Now, it's a whole lot of people, and again, the right way to respond to an invite to connect on LinkedIn is to do a little research. Now, if that little research creates some more interest, do a little bit more research. If that research does a, creates a little bit more interest, then what you might want to do is send that person a message back. you have show you how to do that. And when you send that person a message back, you do that by going right here. And I have other videos that goes in this deeper. And you can absolutely reach out to that person and you can ask them, who are you? and what you want to do. Again, from my network, you've got to go over here and see all 12 or click on whatever's right here and you need to go to the invitation manager page and I can send that person a message and I can ask them a question. Who are you and how can I help you? First of all, again, as I said earlier, the wrong thing to do is immediately hit accept. A missed opportunity would be to immediately hit ignore. Five or 10 seconds worth of research may show you that they're relevant to that connection or clearly that, that, that invite is a fake and you need to get rid of it. But I never hit accept without also messaging. That is vital. Never simply accept a LinkedIn invite. Once you do accept it, try to start a conversation. I'm Teddy your LinkedIn strategist, trainer, and coach. Again, celebrating that we now have 1 billion people on LinkedIn from what I can see and celebrating networking effectively and purposefully on LinkedIn.